which have been the destiny of the bank, not only of the people, but also of the bank. So I declare it open. When I was invited by Mr. Parman for inauguration, I did tell him, even in the last, even the last time when he had invited me, I could not make it because of some hectic schedule that I had. Private sector going in for agricultural farming, agriculture financing. Priority sector, all of you must be knowing the definition, I'm sure, of priority sector, including SSI and transport operators and this and that. So that was a period actually when public sector banking was necessary. And therefore, in a way, Mrs. Gandhi was right in nationalizing 14 major commercial banks in 1969 when she was the Prime Minister. I remember that. I don't know. Many of you are younger, quite younger than me. I'm in my 50s now. I decided in 52, that is my age. From personally witness, verified, you see, the nationalization changes around. When I was a student, I distinctly recall the morning of 19th of July 1960. I don't know how many of you know this, but on 18th of July night, there was a cabinet meeting conducted by Mrs. Gandhi. So the entire cabinet was dead against nationalization. Mrs. Gandhi, as she was known, to be very aggressive with those that particular period. She took her own decision. She dictated the ordinance of nationalization virtually. And at about 4 o'clock in the morning of 19th of July, Mr. President signed that particular ordinance. At 6 o'clock in the morning, the finance minister of this nation, who was totally unaware of nationalization decision, he said, IRDP in Bihar means Inko Rupaya Dena Padega. I'm sure you are getting my point. The point is, there was a time when people were pampered by the finance ministers. When the banks were looted by the finance ministers. I'm making a very bold statement. Yes, I'm aware. But it is indeed a fact that the banks, commercial banks, particularly the nationalized banks, were looted by the bank. Janardan Mujari, who was the minister of finance for state, state minister, I mean, he used to conduct loan villas, call the people around and distribute money as if it is his own personal private property. That was the time and that is the extent to which the public sector banking was taken. No wonder therefore that most of the public sector banks were landing in troubles. Mr. M. Narsimha under his chairmanship you know that financial sector reforms committee was appointed. The committee did submit its report in 1992 to the then finance minister and today's prime minister of the Singh. Narsimha committee had pointed out two things. I will just touch upon those two things and then I will switch over to the present state. May have a luxury of uh, outwardly showing that they are changing but inwardly not changing at all. <laughs> I'm sure you have taken a note of what I have said. <coughs> the sessions hereafter will give you more, more and more theoretical input of marketing as well as the practical solutions of the situations. I'm sure that the faculty who has been invited over here, the faculty members who have been invited over here will definitely do the needful, will give you the best of the available resources and the, the input in the form of giving you the training. I am sure that you will make the most of this particular training in the next sessions to come. I am happy that you have listened to me very carefully because I can read your faces. I have been a teacher myself for the last 31 years. And I know that uh, I can straight away look into your eyes, read into your eyes, see whether you are following me or not. And therefore, I take it to be my pleasure Right to be associated with this particular inaugural function of the training program. Akhirman, 
मैं इतना ही कहना चाहूंगा वक्त का तकादा है कि तूफान से झुंझो कब तक चलोगे किनारे किनारे थैंक यू
जो टॉपिक समझते हैं मैं भी शेयर इट आई वांट टू लर्न टू डिस्कवर मार्केटिंग ऑफ फाइनेंशियल सर्विसेज एंड देन आई हैड दिस एटीट्यूड स्पिरिटुअल बैंक मैनेजर्स ट्रेनिंग लेक्चर एट जेसी बिकॉज़ देन आई फील दैट देयर टू बी अ वेरी डिटेल थीम एंड डिटेल एजेंडा मोस्ट ऑफ टाइम इन बिफोर फॉर सेमिनार्स वन मेन थिंग इज देयर एंड सपोर्टिंग लेक्चरर्स एंड स्पीकर्स आर अरेंज आई वाज टू लेट नो इट्स अ वेरी डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ थिंग एंड ट्रेडिंग बैंक इज अ वेरी डिफरेंट एंड वेरी इनफॉर्मल मेथड सो यू जस्ट कम एंड टेल अस व्हाट एवर इज देयर वी आर ओपन So then I said, fine. I would start from this, but I have prepared this with my team so as to enhance and enlighten you uh, throughout. You can say your personality. So two hours you have to have a great ride with me. At this moment, my portfolio at Cyber is like this. I am lecturing marketing and communication. So the moment student interest for MBA, he is my uh, privilege. At the same time, he is very unfortunate to work with me because I make them work like anything. Number one. And number two is marketing. That is secondary. I teach services marketing, international marketing, and uh, advertising also. Because I have been doing consultancy for 15 years, so my colleagues feel that I am the right person to teach services marketing. Yes. <coughs> What brings us here? Why you are here? <laughs> Most of the time, when it comes to the senior, to, you know, senior participants, nobody wants training. You know, it's a typical training. चलते यार सब कर दिया बस करना पड़ता है पेट के लिए क्या क्या करना पड़ता है दे मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम पीपल टॉक ऑफ अपग्रेडिंग नॉलेज यू नो अपग्रेडिंग नॉलेज व्हाट एवर यू नो इज नॉट सफिशिएंट इनफ फॉर योर प्रोफेशन एंड सर्विस सो अपग्रेड बट मेनी टाइम यू नो मेनी टाइम्स मैनेजमेंट प्रोजेक्ट्स और पार्टिसिपेंट द प्रोजेक्ट लाइक फॉर अ ग्लास बॉस यू नो इट इज ऑलवेज रिटर्न देयर व्हिच साइड आर यू नो सो व्हेन यू से अपग्रेड ट्रेनिंग Uh, we we really need to know which side up please tell us that is what you are looking for then third thing is that do bankers need to know market a marketing because in india especially it is sabse bada prakriya mere paas paisa hai to sab jhukenge you know that sort of culture we need to follow do we really need marketing do bankers need marketing that's a big question i don't know but management thinks that other people should know marketing तो क्या करें तो वी आर देयर इन दिस बैंक फॉर सो मेनी इयर्स सो सो इट इज लाइक दैट एट सम प्लेसेस यू नो वी हैव सर्टेन बजट यू नो मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम इन द बैलेंस शीट्स इट इज मेंटेन मेंशन दैट ओके फॉर एचआर फॉर ट्रेनिंग स्टाफ ट्रेनिंग सम बजट इज देयर एंड इट बिकम्स अ यूनिट सो पीपल वांट टू स्पेंड ऑन अकाउंट्स द मैनेजर्स वांट टू स्पेंड ऑन अकाउंट चेयरमैन दे वांट टू स्पेंड ऑन अकाउंट कलेक्टर्स वांट दिस वांट टू स्पेंड ऑन अकाउंट बिकॉज़ बिफोर दैट इट वाज मच इफ इट इज नॉट स्पेंड it will go back you know that is a big thing so whether it is spending on account maybe it's a very soft and sweet hr policy so it starts with the process okay and then when it comes to you know realizing that you are at fault you are very weak you are very bad you are supposed to go with, go with roses as the professor sir so they said uh, when they hire it is all roses okay but when they fire you have to just carry rose with you you don't get anything that is the way it works if it is really hr policy thing Whether it is RBI which is making you think like this, Reserve Bank of India, you have hundred times if you visit any bank in India, you will see that. Ah, I am not sure. This is how Reserve Bank is doing their rule. The same thing is circular. But you will see that if the bank is not doing its machine or the bank is not circular, then that means the entire amount of the 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 amount Is it is government of India? What is it? What is this thing all about? Why we? Why why we are here? You know why? Why you want to do this? I wish I really don't. These are the questions I have in my mind. I feel like if this is the audience, these are the questions of the people sitting here. If they are not your questions, that's also not a problem for me. If they are the questions, I am trying to give you some answers. So tighten your belts. Are we on the new right? Tighten your belts. Maybe I'm taking you for a very big and new ride. Okay, <laughs> most of the time, like somebody said, Professor Professor Sir was mentioning, he mentioned his age. He said after 40s and days and all that. But I would say forget all that. 40 plus is all a chai. You know, you people believe more in you, and then you know it works in much better ways. So it's a very right age for training. Very right age for training. You know, like I would say that uh, you know as we have very basic law and rules for you know marriage. अठारह साल से पहले नहीं कर देते वैसे ऐसे होना चाहिए कि कोर ट्रेनिंग फोर्टीज के बाद ही होना चाहिए उससे पहले नहीं मिलना चाहिए 
you know, because that is too dangerous. Look at my students, they are so fast, so superior, they will surpass me and throw me. So I am not very sure, you know, next June when I enter my listing, whether they will distract me as teacher or not. So I believe 40 is a very right age to okay? But even then, even then I would say, most of the people sitting here, I know for them, change of place is rest. You know, where I am working on my desk, continuously looking at machine, so change your place is rest and rest you know what is training khana pina sunna you know that sort of thing so if that is that is your point of view let us find out what it is what brings us here whether that is it here next what brings me here this is a lady I met in 2005 in Umarwa there was a great uh, you can say natural disaster to Mahapur Alaga and Tarala Sagra Tumsa Taluka Panam I had come with the student's team in Umarwar and this sort of area. We met the Tasila here in Shiro. I had a team. We can only follow a welcome function and we collect money for that. So students felt there was a lot of great news about it. Media told us that it was a great disaster. So I had come with my student's team and all the money which we collected was given in the form of food packets. Food packets. And she was the lady who was having only one thing of space okay, to stand inside that uh, hut, one small corner of Umarwar. And she was sick. You can see that picture. This was taken by one of my students of 2005. And when we saw that, we were really shocked to know. We were really shocked to know. Just 45 kilometers away from Kolapur, we could see the life and death of people and you know how they, they might have suffered and all that. But it also triggered to me that. If there is so much of great wealthiness, great economic reforms, great social reforms, great RBI, great government of India, why charity has to begin from somebody else on the floor? What are the public finance system doing? That was a tripping alarm from this area, I would say. Though it was a natural disaster, but it, it really clicked me that maybe there is something very wrong going around in this total region. And it was not just Shiro, it was say, the core of southern India or southern Maharashtra that something was going wrong so that you know it is the gap in rich and poor is even increasing even increasing even increasing I believe that when I got the first note from Mr. Bhakre and then I talked to Mr. Palwan I said yes this lady is calling me this lady is calling me we had a small listing so I believe that I have come for this lady so that I can tell the bankers of this region that okay I am an academician fine my job is to tell you that what we are seeing if it is right wrong you please you please find out and try to correct yourself, please. It was this camp that visit to Umarwar and Gocharwadi and Kothmadi, Tal Kashiro on 14th August 2005. As an, as an our extension activity, all good students, we came and we supported that. Next. This is a very great photograph of the same area. You can see all the gods there, all the gods there. And what it has swept, you know, that height totally. Then even gods also fail in this country who is there to really support the people. We talk of great things, we talk of you know, economy, we talk of a lot of reasons. Like Professor Sir's birthday, he's my teacher, he's my senior, I have high regards for him. But that generation speaks of high values, okay? But how to do it now, you know, at this context, we are really failing to understand. That is what your problem is, my problem is there. So this this was this was the case, this was the case uh, when we found it there. And this was a great picture. I didn't have this vision. I was just looking for the packets and I was counting the students. It was my student who made me see this. It was his mobile which captured this image. I believe this brings me here. It's a very important thing. I said, okay, if they are bankers, at least I can talk to them. I will share with them. Yes. Then why we should interact, share with each other and blah, blah together, you know? Why is it required? It is really required. Whether we like it or not, whether we accept it or not, whether we want to go ahead with that or not, we need to meet, we need to talk, we need to interact. You know, what is the reason? By interaction, we will come to know who is right, who is wrong. By this training, you will understand that, okay, this is marketing. You will be able to know that, okay, whether I can do it or not. I will come to know that, you know, this is the way bankers, they go, okay? And I, I may decide for the next listing. But coming together, interacting together, sharing together, you know, makes a very great difference in life, which doesn't require any money. And for you in that case, it doesn't take any interest also, okay? <laughs> coming, interacting and sharing, we did not count in terms of time. 
Okay, because the moment bankers start counting in time, interest chapter is up. So that is a very dangerous situation. You should, you can, you can meet, you can talk interest free. No interest man me rakte, nahi hue bhi. Aap kaam kar sakte ho. That is what is required. So before we really go with that, we need to interact and share all this for our different purposes. Your purpose is different, my purpose will be different, but we are selling the same boat. Okay. So for that matter, let us first empty our cups. The first is hand stored. Role play is a technique where you know they enact and show you uh, the actual situation, like it's a sort of acting. Yes. The, the core part which I first read was like this. 
that when this fellow started doing the research, a great uh, Stockholm Economic Institute funded it. He said, when I really started this study, he, remind, he was reminded of a Greek story. What was the Greek story? That a king of war was first, in, you know, once invited by king of love, okay, for for a dinner, okay. So it's a Greek story, so they will always have a wine and this. But you understand, uh, king of war, or you say god of war, okay, when enter, while entering to god of love, you know, war is nothing else but destruction. So the moment the god started entering the gates of god of love, the gate was destroyed, the, the, the way he entered, everything was getting destroyed and destroyed and destroyed. So in that spirit, what happened finally, there was only table left, and the moment god of war rich, God of war, rich God of love, there was only one wine cup on the table and a very small kitten, small cat was just sleeping in and you know, trying to drink that wine. That is what happened. So such a great man who has written such a three volumes book okay, on Asian drama is nothing else but an inquiry into the poverty of the nations. He wrote that despite of such, uh, you can say, extensive research and all his findings, he was isolated by Western countries. So he was in Sweden throughout his life and for his great work, this inquiry into poverty of nations, I believe most of you were uh, you know, witness to all, all that what he has written. It's a quick reminder to you. Because I was told that marketing, principally everybody says it is needed. But for banker, unless it is having some strong economic base, you know, I understand that senior people like you cannot connect yourself to the marketing. So I have, I have some content of this which I want to share with you. But really to understand the importance of it, please, please, please see to it that you start reading. Start reading like a child, okay? Okay, because this is Sandar Ashmi. You know what he says? Kitabe karti hai baate bite zamano ki, dunya ki, insano ki, aaj ki, kal ki, ek ek pal ki, khushiyon ki, gamo ki, phoolo ki, bamo ki, jeet ki, haar ki, pyaar ki, maar ki. क्या तुम नहीं सुनोगे इन किताबों की बातें किताबें कुछ कहना चाहती है तुम्हारे पास रहना चाहती है अनफॉर्चुनेटली और फॉर्चुनेटली तुम्हारे पास किताबें जो होती है उसमें सब आंकड़े ही होते हैं और कस्टमर के पास पासबुक रहती है इफ यू रियली वांट टू गो बियॉन्ड दैट यू वुड हैव टू दैट द सेम रिवॉल्यूशन ग्रेट रिवॉल्यूशन ऑफ इकोनॉमी दैट वाज हैपनिंग इन अनदर कंट्री व्हाट वर्ल्ड वाज थिंकिंग अबाउट प्लीज नेक्स्ट Gunnar Middel was born on 6 December 1898 and was a Swedish economist and politician. He was born in uh, this Gisdas Dalna and died in uh, that place, uh, very close to Stockholm. Okay, this is all his wife. He, along with uh, one of the co-authors, won the 1974 Nobel Prize for Economics for their pioneering work in the theory of money and economic fluctuations and for their penetrating analysis of the interdependence of economic, social and institutional phenomena. It's very important. Nobody in the world, you know, like Professor Sir there was there, but he, he always talks of systems and economies, you know. So economists always believe that they will be away from the system, look at you and say, ah, look, do it like that, do it like that, you know. It's like Chimadrana Kuala Shikola Sarkar. That that doesn't work. These these economics theories, international economists, they, that is a very different stream. Who has really understood what Asia is? I'm not talking about global one. I'm not talking about federal map. I'm not talking about just Asia. I'm talking about the entire Asia. You know all that he has found in all six big nations, okay? And how how he has understood the entire process of. It. So this was the pioneering work, theory of money and economic fluctuations for their penetrating analysis of interdependence of economic, social and institutional phenomena. He is very famous because after this he wrote this American dilemma. Most of the time when we talk of all this, you know, marketing and all that, we simply shift to Kotler and all international authors like that. And that marketing goes with goody goody things, you know. You always smile, as he said, smiling first and all that, then roses, then dollars. And the moment dollars are over, no smile, nothing you have thrown out. Okay? That is altogether different. And all of you sitting here have that value-based conflict inside. When it finally comes to that, because you are not just selling a product, you are giving money to people. Okay? And in that case, when the risk starts rising, you can't keep it up. So it's, it's basically for people in financial services, they are dealing directly with money. 
Okay, there are people, there are doctors who are expert of brain, maybe you know ortho and all that. But somebody who is actually a cardiac surgeon, okay, who is simply connected to heart, for him the responsibility and the time is totally different. It is something of that sort of relationship which he has found out with economy, which I want to share with you. Please. So he said, this is last one, right? The dialogue is between high ideals on the one hand and poor performance on the other. I believe that he wrote it about America in the 60s. And now while, while we are in the boat of globalization, where we are, we are into this high ideals and poor performance. So every time for small, small things, we have to struggle. We have to struggle a lot. Why? Because I am not suppose, I am not responsible, but somebody else who was responsible did not do well. So I am suffering. And we accept it. We accept it. And we, we, we simply accept it as a part of destiny. You know, as a part of destiny, you know. So how how he has related all this, I just want to clear it up, please. This is his lecture, these are the excerpts which I want to share with you. Uh, this, this is the one which he gave on March 17, 1975. <coughs> now this is part of his lecture. I don't want to, I got a lot of information, so I'll give you a CD. You can just have it with you because you need it. That's what I believe. The core of it I have put it for you. I want you to think about it. It's very important. Much more generally, people keep conservatively to their consumption habits. Your customers, finally they want to develop. You want to finance them for their development, direct or indirect. But they should do it in a syntactic, logical, legal and financial disciplined manner which you can't tell them. Or which you cannot, which is not your job. Or which you cannot hold on for. Because you are also worried with your figures and ratios and all that. Okay? That is, that is what is there. But even then, what he is talking is that people, that means your customers, they are very conservative in consumption habits. And that you will find everywhere in India. Even if you are too advanced also, very high high also, high tech also, your sons, daughters, grandsons, you know, might be in US, the grandfather would be typical Indian. You know, he, he will be very conservative about particular thing. They don't want to be reformed, even in their own interest even in their own interest. Okay? In our competitive society, all groups are instead always brought to press for more of the same type of consumption. When we say competitiveness, when we talk about competitive things, we want to see that, okay, you also use tight and you also use tight and all of us let us go for Nike, Bata and all that. No, we are trying to press. If people are very conservative to accept anything, you know, that is very, very important. So the consumption factor leads to triggering of mobility of money and mobility of money is associated with your service. How you handle it, that is where the very important thing is. Our politicians of all political parties stick to the inact concept of growth. Our politicians are growth of growth. What are the people Vikas, Samartha Saad, Jhende, Rally, all that. Okay, everybody talks of this. Everybody talks of this. The definition of growth from politicians' point of view is something different. We economists like Dr. Sarsapadhyay or like me, faculty, we academicians, we stick more to the concept. And what we do? By not having scrutinized more intensively that even statistically rather spurious concept. So manager is more bothered about the ratios and the figures statically at a point of time, you know, when the day ends. In the morning, he's like a king, you know. He's waiting for the prey to come in because he's a banker. Okay, and in the evening, he's mad and dead and sad because he cannot shut down the new network technology machine. You know, the pura suba bhot shed resa hota hai. Shana ko bas uska pheri ban jata hai. Kyo banta hai? Spurious concept mein attack hai. Spurious concept mein attack hai. Because he has not planned his life. He is a victim. Whether he is a victim of a system or lead out of so many analysts, I really don't know. But that is that is curiosity of concept. Concept is that if you die, you die. No, you can't work. Okay. And by us, it is commonly utilized in growth in that sense, uncritical. We use the growth concept in a very different way. As a main value premise in our discussion of practical economic. Everybody has big dreams. How to do it practically? How to go about it? That, that is what you have come here. There may be very great ideas, very great things. That practical thing requires, you know, a critical base, a very shrewd base. A very shrewd base. So what my student could show me in that photograph, okay, all the gods together and all that, has taught me something of last 10 years, which I could not teach him for 2 years in market. You understand this? 
That is very important. But in that case, I have to be very critical. I have to forget my age, knowledge, and all that. So in that case, if I really want to stick to the practical economic theory, what we will do it. Have unfortunately contributed to restricting the mental horizon of politicians and of the common people. We are the common people and politicians together, and our mental horizon is restricted with this basic thing. This basic thing. So sometimes you are a victim of the growth concepts of politicians because they are they have influenced you. Sometimes you are a victim of spurious concept. Okay, created by all the economists and all these theories, and then your customer thinks that for him growth is what Windows 95 to XP. उसको कितना पैसा चाहिए? पहले 12,000 रुपए में मिलता था, अभी 6,750 में Windows मिलता है. लेकिन मेरे गली में कोई use नहीं करता है. So I'm not bothered. I'm bothered for some pirated thing. No, that is the way I want to go it. That is my customer's goal. So as a banker, I know that if he pirated bill, then why will he take it? So if he shows me the bill of original Microsoft OEM supplier, I'm not sure how to authenticate that. But if I go, can I tell him? How is it possible? But I know that if that person gets a laptop for his son or daughter, his life is going to change. So you as a banker, when you are doing some something in terms of service and marketing, the problem is this: how do I practically do it? The very important thing, what Colonel Mitchell has said in his speech is, most important is to change the relation between man and land. This has been continuously happening, continuously happening. Like uh, Professor Sarsu, you are referring nationalization, this, that, many things are there. Okay? <coughs> many things were simply put on your head from you know, top to bottom, because that is the way, because we are basically not colonial like British or square. Okay? अपने कड़े सरकार में शायद फार्म वर्षा है, क्योंकि अपने कड़े तेजी सो है, तेजी सो है, क्योंकि वरना कहते हैं जोरा ठक कर धरा वरना जापन डाके में जिस सो है अपने, अपने लोग गुलामी करने में जिस सो है, क्योंकि अपने कड़े जाते हैं जीवन, we can't get rid of it, we can't get rid of this imperialism, okay? and in that process we don't understand what exactly is going to work, but this relation between man and land, that change, you are the people who bring it, you have to make it very scientific, creating the possibilities and the incentives for the man to work more. Work harder and more efficiently, and to invest whatever he can lay his hands on to improve the land. उसको खुद के हाथों से करना आना चाहिए, करना आना चाहिए. He should be very confident. He needs that sort of support, you know. That okay, okay. If you say fine, yes, this support is there. I'm happy. उसके खुद के हाथों से करना आना चाहिए उसको. उसके लिए आप क्या दे सकते हैं? If you can think on that, that is that is the core of it. That is the core of it. This was Gretel was telling you. In 60s, okay. At that time, he was so old, you know. And this lecture is delivered in 74, 74. Okay. I think I was doing my. I must have been in fourth or fifth or sixth time because I read this book in 83 or something like that. Okay. They have proved ineffective to reach the masses of agriculturists. This is the comment for entire Asia. I mean, there is a part of it. There is a part of it. Okay. Because I know my my first sentence in my management class is that. 80% of the students who come to MBA are from commerce stream and they write one sentence India is an agricultural country and 80% of the population is agriculturist Are kya? Mera farmer hero honda leke khumta hai, thamsak pita hai Is he not changed? Is he not changed? So why do I assume you know, a very wrong mental horizon blockage in me and I accept it sitting as a manager, as a pune or as a clerk or as somebody, why? Why? The reason is I am like really trying to hide something from my mind. You know, we are just holding something that is not, not supposed to be held like this. So in the first instance, by his own labors, that is how he can improve the relation. There are a number of auxiliary reforms in regard to market. I have I have highlighted the word market. He said that long back. What did you do? I mean to say RBI, not you. What did you do in terms of market and extension services? Most of the things you accrued it, okay, in your accounts. Chavan is a bill, Karmachari Prashikshan, Uttadre Khadhe, Udghada, Udghada is a photo. Just so called required PR for that. Because you were told like that. You were told like that. You were taught like that. You believe in that. Okay. So, you, you were the victim of occupational tricks. Banker Khali interest in you. Count the bill. Like, you know, there is one of my friends who is not literate. 
आणि तुम्हाला नेहमी असं उदाहरण सांगतो की बस जो कंडक्टर असतोय त्याला घरी जरी झोपायचं असेल तरी त्याला अशी वाट खालवायला येते ओके बस कंडक्टर को कर्मी तो भी सोचता है तो उसको वेट को ऐसे हिलाना पड़ता है क्योंकि उसको ऐसे ही आदत होती है जैसे टाइमर को बस यू नो दैट फिगर यू नो दैट नंबर उसके अलावा भी कोई जीवन है उसके उसके साथ भी और कुछ है तो अंडरस्टैंड दैट एंड देन एक्ट मोर साइंटिफिकली यू वुड हैव डन इट यू कैन नाउ आल्सो डू इट बट यू शुड यू शुड अंडरस्टैंड दैट दैट चेंज दैट मेंटल होरिजन चेंज इन पार्ट व्हिच यू वुड हैव डन प्रोबेबली मेनी ऑफ यू हैव डन दैट आल्सो तुम इतने केले लाइक लाइक सर सो तुमने सर सेड दैट ड्यू टू रिलेशनशिप ओनली आई डिड इट दैट मींस अभी तुम्हारा कहीं नवीन सांगत नहीं हो You are maintaining the relationship. You need to translate that into business proposition. How to do that is is the core. That is very important. That is very important. So they, this this mark, ये जो ठप्पा है अपने banking और finance system में, ये change करने के लिए आप सब की जरूरत है। वो अकेले finance minister नहीं कर सकता। Government is trying very hard to push you. You know the reason why? Because they have failed to do it or they cannot do it. They could not afford it. So now the entire financial community is needed to correct it. Accept it. There is nothing wrong about it. Next man. Next man was Amit Singh, who was thrown out of India in the 50s only. Okay, he is a man of Shanti Niketan. This is saying at the outset in itself it might seem like an unremarkable fact, but it is actually it is not. Amit Singh is a citizen of India. While most of his countrymen who have been able to leave India for a long time. Try their best to become citizens of the country they might have gone to Britain, America, Canada, Australia. Send a man whom Cambridge and Harvard are said to have fought over for the privilege of offering an appointment resolutely retains his blue Indian passport after half a century of towering intellectual achievements across the world. This is a very famous book, Argumentative Indian. If you find some time, please read that. There was Edward D. Bono, who is expert in you know psychology and personality and so many skills. I, I remember sometimes back, Madhavan back, Economic Times had the headline: Indians are too argumentative. आप उसको कुछ भी बोलो, conductor के साथ, चाय वाले के साथ, bank वाले के साथ, insurance वाले के साथ, छोटी-छोटी चीज के लिए ज़्यादा argument ही करता है। हमारा system ही ऐसा है, हमारा माहौल ही ऐसा है। I have a right to argument only when the situation demands argumentation. If situation is not demanding, why I should waste the time, you know? So he has put his life there. And if you remember, when he was given Nobel Prize, okay, he said, India, I know. Kya karna chahiye? Bas, you know what you do? Train the females. Aap, females who have proper education, they have higher education, things could change. He told him, at that time, Bachpe was there, right? He was the prime minister. He was called. But he was thrown out of India long back because all that he was talking, nobody believed. He did some some work on famines and you know many great disasters. That's why Shirora ne Murwata Sapura. He kaay that natural disasters kaay that. That's why he inka sundar a best killer. He said it is nothing else but it is an indirect accumulated corruption. He has proven it with econometric theories and Oxford has accepted it. So what was you better than your own self? Jagala mai ke tumi tumi kaise aate kum cha bech. तुम्हारा स्वतः माइंड में भी शर्ट टूटला है अगर मदर चश्मा टूटला है नंबर्स है क्यों मतलब चाह में साफ़ करके दिला विज़र तुम्हारा भी चला कितने शक्कर लेते हैं आप चाय में घर में जो आपकी बीवी बनती है आपको मालूम है डू यू नो इट इट इस समथिंग लाइक दैट इट इस रियली समथिंग लाइक दैट ओके he is the man who first created this theory. Okay? The Kabbalistic approach is a conceptual framework developed by Amartya Sen and his colleague. It emphasizes functional capabilities, that is substantial freedom. These are constituting terms of substantial freedoms people have reason to value, instead of utility or access to resources, commodities. A very important thing, poverty is understood as capability deprivation. Now there are a lot of my junior students. That boy sitting here worked in MCV for two three years, and now he has joined MBA course. He was there to train small entrepreneurs, make you know project proposals. I have categorically brought students who have previously worked in different contexts. They have different different capacities, but they are told, "Ye nahi karna hai, wo nahi karna hai," without knowing their capability. Anybody's capability, if you deprive, ye mat karo. Okay, even if you don't have right, we tell. Okay, that is all. That is poverty. That is what Amartya Sen says. Try to understand the human element of it because you want to market services. 
You know your own profession first. That service, that is very important. <coughs> he has defined ten capabilities. First is life. That is being able to live to the end of human life of normal life, not dying prematurely or before once is so reduced as to be not worth living. Bodily health, being able to have good health, including reproductive health, to be adequately nourished, to have adequate shelter. Bodily integrity, being able to move freely from places to places, to be secure against violent assault, including sexual assault and domestic violence. Having opportunities for sexual satisfaction and for choice in the matters of reproduction. Senses, imagination and thought, being able to use the sense to imagine, think and reason and to do the things in truly human way. A way informed and cultivated by adequate education, including, but by no means limited to literacy and basic mathematical and scientific training. We, we, we have all the time neglected this. How many of you really know that how, how your customers are there? The other day I went to Adhacho branch to see how your working is there and collected your annual report. I met one of my old friend. He was a fingerprint entrepreneur. He was an entrepreneur, fingerprint entrepreneur. That means his bank ka jo bhi usne kiya, wo jal gaya. 1997 depression mein I found him there. But the way he used to talk in 1997 was like, you know, the kingmaker of the law. But after you know all that reforms and this recession and all that, he was cool. Previously he had a big car, Shogun was there, now it was Maruti 800 and he himself drove it. But then I was happy, okay, finally, whether it is Ganesh Bank or Federal Bank, he, he was not the driver of the office capacity. I said fine, because I've been seeing him, I've seen him trying some new ideas in the society to develop something new, which was not just criticized but held supported and again deaccumulated. You know? That is, that is the right, that is a very important thing. Next thing. <coughs> then emotions. Practical reason. This is very important. Being able to form a conception of the good and to engage in critical reflection about the planning of one's life. Affiliation. Being able to live with and toward others to recognize and show concern for the other human beings to engage in various forms of social interaction. Protecting this capability means protecting institutions that constitute and nourish such forms of affiliation and also protecting the freedom of assembly and by political speech. Having the social basis of self-respect and non-humiliation, being able to be treated as dignified being whose worth is equal to that of others. This entails provisions of non-discrimination on the basis of race, sex, sexual orientation, ethnicity, caste, religion, national origin. I was talking to some of you people. I still understand that some of us still have regionalism. I talk of Kolhapur and Desipur, I talk of Maharashtra and Kerala, I talk of you know ethnicity and race. Why? Why we can't accept the national spirit, you know, and we say that we are just Indians. You know, that's a very important thing. We still have this regional box inside our mental horizons. If we really have that, then we cannot sit on the chair of manager. Okay, if you are allowed to sit, sit, that's fine. Don't take the risk, that is also fine. But then have an open eyesight, that is very important. Understand the human nature first, that is very important. Okay? Because the way your conceptual thing is there, that you are projecting, and person sitting inside that projection okay, is very weak, insecure, and not very clear about what. And he is using the wrong scale to measure the market. If you have this scale, you can measure the market, then you can always be successful. When you cannot see a particular thing, okay, what you have to do is that broaden the windows. Okay. When the entire IT industry was under turmoil, okay, it was windows by Bill Gates. He created, you know, he created a very different visual cosmetics to the same simple DOS. But then he led everybody to change to that. And every year he is doing that. Every year he is doing that. And he is doing it very professionally. He is just 44 or 46 years old. But he generated so much of wealth. So much of wealth. And if you know the Explorer software which is created, there are 600 Indians. Why they went to Silicon Valley? They went to Silicon Valley because they were not hurt, their capacities were deprived. Because what they really were trying, they were the wealth makers, they had to go. They had to run away with the entire family. They had to run away with the entire family. And then our fathers and grandfathers and they cry. They say they mean, but they are very smart. हरवे बैठते हैं वेब कैंप यहाँ हाँ अच्छा है जरा लड़की को दिखाओ लड़की को दिखाओ अरे क्यों आप जाओ ना जाओ अभी डेट कर निकला है वो बैठा है मल्ला उधर तुमको बस सब पानी डालो सब मिला के अमेरिका भेज सकता है यू स्पेंड यू कैन डू इट आई यू थिंक 
you are selling like that. Make your customers strong and bold. Your finances, your finances. Basic capacity deprivation. You are not supposed to tell your customer how to live. But try to understand, if you know this, you have been working with this, this mental horizon block is really good. This affiliation is very important. Affiliation is a big program in society, and a lot of insult like that. दिल्ली में कुछ किसी ने नहीं पूछा चलता है गली में मुझे जो है ना बहुत प्यार मिलना चाहिए वो बहुत जरूरी है इफ यू डिस्कार्ड देम डिस्कार्ड देम यू यू आर द ग्रेट कंफ्लिक्स ऑफ द सोसाइटी ग्रेट कंफ्लिक्स ऑफ द सोसाइटी नेक्स्ट प्लीज सो लास्ट डिस्प्ले या कंट्रोल ओवर वंस एनवायरमेंट दिस इज आल्सो द कैपेबिलिटी एवरी ह्यूमन बीइंग हैज being able to participate effectively in political and choices that govern one's life having the right of political participation protections speech and association being able to hold properly and having property rights on an equal basis with others having the right to seek employment on an equal basis with others having the freedom from unlimited <coughs> search and seizure in work being able to work as human being exercising practical reason and entering into meaningful relationships of mutual recognition with each other this doesn't require who you are this doesn't ask you age it doesn't doesn't ask you race this doesn't ask you religion this doesn't ask you any caste creed any damn thing just accept that you are human you are not a tree or you are not a bull that's all you are human okay these basic things if you could understood along with your banking numbers and balance sheets things could have been different Now is the time for the same story because you know we we really want to know how to enter into the marketing part. Okay, you can just play it in English. Okay, do it comfortably. Yes.
I think this background was very much essential to discuss with you when we talk about marketing. Because nowadays, we are bachado to marketing for this tap, 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 you know. 8 o'clock morning meeting, breakfast, SMS, this, burger and all that, they know it. Because they have not seen the suffering of what we have seen. So they are not supposed to see that. I, I got my two-wheeler vehicle when I was doing my BSc. Till that time I was using bus. Okay, my father got his first Lambrata when he was in 45 of his age. Okay, so it was a class transfer slowly, you know, all this system was doing. Your sons and daughters have many things right at home. You have to them. Your customers also have them. So they don't know a few of the sufferings and old value part of the things, okay? So in that case, when you want to address your market, you should have this, you know, this with a fresh approach, fresh mind. Just take it as an input, slowly start using it. What are the core concepts in marketing? Because the purpose of business is to create and keep customers, it has only two central functions, marketing and innovation. And I believe that you are so honest, all of you sitting here, that you do marketing, but you don't know innovation. Or you don't get time to innovate. Or if you want to innovate, there are others in that mental block who will say, Nani, I am a federal bank. While I was coming, I was playing with the word because I started my career you know, as a copywriter. The federal kya, you know, because we previously used to have cluster of this thing and all that. Then the Marathi synonym of that is, Fedler a Fedler. That is, that is the simple basic, you know. All that, whatever turmoil was there, you know, it has brought you out of that. So it's not a conflict of brands or cultures or people. It is something more than that. If you think like that, things are much better. Because it is a basic thing for your survival at the same time growth. When I work in an education institute, there are people like me, there are people like my senior and my founder president is 76 years old. He not even uses mobile, okay. But we work hand in hand. I know technology, I know this, so he will call me. I don't know few things, I cannot <coughs> say hold my new patients, he's there to help me out. So it is not the divide, no? it's not digital divide, it's not age divide, it's not knowledge divide. We have to come together, more informal. <coughs> if we will remove all this from our heads, then I think things would change. That barriers which we have inside us can create this and keep the customer, keeping the customer. For you, if it is only saying yes for the loans and no for the loans means effective marketing or no ineffective marketing, please get out of it. That concept is very important. Marketing concept. Achievement of corporate goals through meeting and exceeding customer needs better than the competition. Competition with corporate goals are clean sign of the dinner. So you are like guide to the federal banks, those who are locals. Okay? You guide cinema the So you are guides, you are guides, okay? You know the right spirit of the location. So you can do wonders. You can again repaint the canvas in a very different way. Maharashtra of this region, I don't know from which we are, all regions we have come, but I believe that most of the time, you know, southern Indian part you are there. Okay? So it's very rich. We have abundance of water. You know, water water rich places what they do? A lot of abundance and a lot of wealth is there. It needs to be converted into a big channel of you know, growth. How to do that is only bankers know it, nobody else. Khali marketing wala nahi kar sakta hai, bankers hi kar sakta hai. Second concept, customer orientation. Corporate activities are focused upon providing customer satisfaction. Customer satisfaction nekna jaduri hai. Integrated report, all staff will accept the responsibility for creating customer satisfaction. It's not managed, no? most of the time, we have Babu Raja, Manager Sagan and Chabal Sam. They are our book too. Benza Pura Lan is the book. I mean, that guy is a middle name, oh. Okay? This is, this is again colonism, you know? Sigra Saiba, risk responsibility in that side and all that. Get rid of it. That is old. That is old now. Okay? Integrated effort is required. All of you should think together that it is possible. Goal achievement, that is the belief that corporate goals can be achieved through customer satisfaction. You don't bother about goals, figures and that, you know, report and percentages. You bother about meeting people and getting them inside your bank first. Then you can say no to them, okay? It's not that you carry a list like conduct friends saying like, Ah, achi hai gila, you must work out of time. Ah, agar ane wala hai, toi dekhun ga, then to chalo, aage chalo. You know, it's not like that. It's not like that. You can be a good friend of the society. Be a good friend of society. All the time you are not a banker. When you sit in that chair with the machine system and all that, fine. So act 
act as a factor when you sit on that chair with the machine, when you are supposed to see the ratios and all. But when it comes to working on it, you are a human being. If you understand this difference, and as Professor Sarasuddha, they say, change your role and act, you can do all this. You can really do all this. Next. Next. What is development of marketing knowledge? Quickly at this question. Origin of modern marketing can be traced to the industrial revolution that took place in Britain around 1750 and in the USA and Germany around 1830. Advances in production and distribution and the migration of rural masses to urban areas created the potential for large scale markets. As business people sought to exploit these markets, the institution of marketing such as advertising, media and distribution channels began to grow and develop. Marketing as a field of study began in the early part of the 20th century, growing out for courses that examine issues related to distribution. The focus of marketing in 50s and 60s was on how to do it, with an emphasis on the technique of marketing in more recent times. Attention has been paid to the philosophy of marketing as a way of doing business and to the nature and impact of marketing on stakeholders and society in general. It's a great journey. It started with John Swan. It started with the mask of the camera. It was just trade first, then converted into exchange, then it was merchandising, then we called it commerce, then you know, James Watt, then the revolution. Okay, again reinventing the wheel into trains and mode of transport. Slowly the mobility of the world increased from Newton to Einstein. Okay? The whole thing has changed. At that time we were deprived of we fighting with Britishers. But now it is high time that we are riding on the earth and we really want by two zero, I think one zero, you know, some targets are there as put up by Dr. Kalam. So are we really the part of it if you understand it? The core part is that this is something new which you may not know, but you know, but you didn't know that this is what you are looking for. <coughs> so this is market. This was just cool. what are services? Like he said, one very basic thing, please understand. There is always a difference in product and service. Products are tangible. You can see them, you can touch them, you can feel them. You take them home, you use, throw, whatever is there. Services, you cannot do that. They are intangible. The moment I give the lectures, my students go out of the channels. Service perish is there. If I expect that to be a girl, the Adiko and Shikole, the two Sada rest, the old up and the Akali, the Hasla and the Topol and the Telephone and the name, we move ahead. Services they perish. You are a banker, you are a financial service provider. What is your job? People come to you because you know it. I don't know it. I cannot calculate the interest. I don't have capital. I don't have money. I have some resources I want to. Services are perishable and intangible. They cannot be measured. So, if you, you know, if you really want to measure, it depends on the size of your heart. Aapka heart kitna bada hai, tumhare customer ka heart kitna ho. Us par mirbar ka. Intangible, highly intangible. For bankers, services are unnamed bulletins. Okay? Or some odd figures. That doesn't mean that bulletins are no. They are guideposts. They are guideposts. But rest of that is freedom. Rest of that is freedom. You have to look at it from that point of view. Intangible used to be very properly understood. Very properly understood. My teacher of law used to give an example that Adam Mishra is called for some honorable, say, function, and then she comes and you know, there is the charity students have distributed tickets, this and that. All of a sudden, Adam Mishra says, he used to teach us contract that. So, first offer was given acceptance and all agreements, sub sub. So, the government is going to sign for the other day, now, for the day, 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 and all that. Okay, fine. She comes to Kolabur, goes to Banana, you know, she eats Pandra, Pandra, and all that. Okay, goes to Kalabai Chakra. And then, can she really say that I cannot sing? My driver will come and sing. You never had an agreement with you. Whether is it possible under the enforceability of that act? That is a very typical problem. My teacher of law used to teach us. Can you really do it? Why? It is Lata Mangeshwar only who can do it. Because the services are in nature. What I can do is that only technology is partly supporting me. I create the cassette. But the fun of cassette is different and fun of life shows is different. It is always going to make a difference. In time, we used to have this like that. In separability, the way I am trying to correlate the things, it is my ability, okay? You cannot, you cannot separate me from what I am talking and connect. I'll ask my student, or I'll ask some of your resources, or ask somebody from say very senior position in class, they would do it in a different way. Services are with you. 
I cannot drive, okay? So for, for me today, the driver who took us here was more important because he can drive. And he cannot be separated from that. I cannot say, you sit there, 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 you know? Inseparable, okay? जो आपको करना है वो आप ही को करना है उसके लिए कोई frustration या tension नहीं होना चाहिए that is very very important inside non transferable you cannot transfer the service आप ऐसा नहीं कर सकते कि अरे लोग मैं customer के आगे भी बंद करो कल से आ जाऊँगी मुझे बहुत काम है थोड़ा आप मेरे चेयर पर बैठ के मैंने तो इतना भी एक करोड़ दे दिया तो मैं बाकी business बढ़ा दूँगी you know you cannot transfer the relation it is the basic responsibility कोई भी service ले लो you cannot just think it like that. You have to be physically present. That's very important. And quality is function of perceptual experience. Quality जो है service में customer को आप कितना भी अच्छा present करो उसको अगर समझ भी नहीं आता है तो उसके perception से बोलेगा ये बहुत चंगा है, बहुत बेकार है। इस perception को जिस समझूं तो इतने खर्च सकते ना वे। It is matter of experience. It keeps on changing. It keeps on rolling. It keeps on changing. You should be open to that. Okay, 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 okay. You should create a channel of communication in such a way that you keep on delivering it. But understand that the day is over, the services are delivered, your job is over. If you believe that आज किया हुआ जो काम है, उसके लिए कोई मुझे आपके रिवार्ड देगा? If you are frustrated, if you are hurt by your customers, even though you help them wrong times also, don't be frustrated. Understand the profession, the services. There is a difference in service, social service and professional service. You are a professional service. You are a professional service. Okay, the moment you are out of the bank, you be a human being. Then just keep away all these things. That's fine. But in that case, don't bring business. Don't do that. It is totally different. And that is what is demand of time. Being more professional. That is what I say. The major difference in the education of services marketing versus regular marketing is that instead of the traditional four means, you know, any marketing requires product, price, Place and promotion. <coughs> These are the four P's everywhere taught in terms of marketing. Many of you must be doing it. But in case of uh, this, addition is people, physical evidence, and process. But most of you are the victims of physical evidence. Physical evidence. But the shikkeda kaagdala is a little bit of a little customer kada 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 Because from there the authority to you know that relationship and again that occupational trait I would say that I will not criticize you because you are tika ne kada kada You have been trained like you do your occupation thing has been like that Why? Because the economic thinking of the country was like that So you are not responsible for that but time has come you have changed if suppose I give you some more comfortable way to live, why don't you accept it? That is what market is telling you. Please, I have been talking. I am talking about sale, I am talking about marketing, I am talking about military and so many things. So what it has to do with the bank like this? And I would say yes. Uh, what we are trying to do is try to understand the economic scenario of banking and hurdles in accepting the function of marketing as a part of business. All of us know because we have many customers who are in trade, marketing, they can say more than that, they say, you are going to be a bug, they say, you are going to be a bug, but to accept it, to accept it for your own service also is the great burden. So I felt that I was told that banker ke paas ja rahe ho, to khali marketing bolo ke toh, so bolo ke wow, wow, chan chan. I said, no, I said, okay, I will study everything because I am a strong lover of economics and economic theory. I said, okay, I will just find out the power of the world. And I found three Nobel laureates. Those were in the middle. Second was under the same in my lap because I had translated one of these articles for Delhi to Hari when he was given Nobel. Okay, and I was surprised that with just my small email to request that I want to translate. Within 12 hours, I had received the reply. I was given permission free of cost. Okay, and I translated. And at that time, I read the book Inequalities Day Sun. And then I understood. Then I understood how things work. There is a lot of anthropology into banking and especially marketing of services, financial services. Madhav Bhavashya Shastra is a good samandha. You know, when it comes to banking especially when you want to. That is what you know, Amrita Singh taught me. That is the way it works. So if you feel that I am not on the track, no, I know what is my job. For what I am called here, okay, I am doing it. But I am trying to, trying to, you know, just hit, hit the nail to see that. All, all that your ideas are there. <coughs> all your cups will be empty. 
At the same time, I want to feed a very nice, delightful tea, okay, which will be enriching you like anything. So I said, keep away all this. I have, I have many pages. I give you 400 MB, okay? All these articles, references, including the speech of Mr. Rakesh Mohan, Deputy <coughs> Governor, I Just that which he delivered on 4th December in Yale University. Everything that, you know, Reserve Bank of India is doing. I was told that banker ko batana hai to pehle economics ke baare mein jaruri hai baat karna and second is that always use the word RBI wo sab sun rahe hai you know always use the word RBI wo sab sun rahe hai baaki kuch bhi bola to nahi ho sakta I said okay fine they didn't click to me I am not using the word RBI but I felt that I felt that a quick understanding of economy and all this thing in a global perspective is a need for you because my job is to satisfy you not your customers so I felt that this was needed the purana hisab tha I felt that I should just give it to you, give it to you. Having understood the audience, okay? I am not here to take away some from something. I am not criticizing you in person, your bank in person, or that bank in person. They are global. We should be open for all free and fair person. If you look at that, things can change. Next. This is the problem. Here, here is where you should go with. This is an apply to it. You are the part of from value-based banking to Brand value-based banking. You can see here. We always talk of poverty. Okay, you have been working in value-based banking, and what is new banking? My Brand. Brand value-based banking. That is the conflict in the market. That is the conflict in the market. Am I right? I could see some smiles on the faces. That is your problem, right? And that that keeps you boiling inside. Aapko sab samajhta hai, sab samajhta hai. Fir bhi. That is the problem, that is the problem. Because our picture is like this. India is an agricultural country, 80% of the population is like this. Okay, we always look at this. So you go. Sab, you know, Bhagavan ki diya, sympathy, 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 humble, humble, humble. Rashtra ki us mein bhaag jalke. Okay, and then that problem is growth, spurious concept of numbers, and this. And who is the victim? Not the, not the professor, not the finance minister, poor banker. So you are chup hai. Wo sab circulars pat. सब नियम नियम के साथ कर इस रिक्ति डेट इस डेट इस रिक्ति डेट इस रियलिटी सो नोबडी इज़ गोइंग टू कम एंड हेल्प यू आउट ओके नो पार्ट नो एडी यू हैव टू चेंज यू हैव टू बिकम सेक्युलर यू हैव टू फाइट आउट टू वे आई नोट टू वे हाउ यू कैन डू इट ब्रांड्स दिस इज़ शुड यू सेंड ही वाज़ ए ग्रेट मैन and he is the man who created Lalita Ji and he gave a lot of consultancy to serve and other things. Okay? So he is talking about brand. What is brand related things associated with market? Brands are important from their points of view. First, they have a role to play in the marketplace. Second, the consumers are impacted by brands in their purchase decision. And finally, there is a company or a corporate perspective as to the role of a brand. The market, the consumer, the company, these are the three things. You have to look at it very broadly, very broadly. So jurisdiction is not so important. How many of you really think, you, yourself, that you are global? You might be thinking that I am this place, that place. Yeah, get up any manager, cash, get rid of it. If you have a cell phone, BSNL phone and internet, you are global. Very simple, very simple. If you cannot remove that block, then you are at trouble. You are at trouble. That perspective is very much important. Create relevance between similar products. Remove uncertainty. As a banker, you should first remove the uncertainty. What? Dunya ki uncertainty mat karo yaar remove. Wo baitha ko dar upar karne ke liye. Aap jo samne wala aa raha hai na, usko bas clear karo. Usko samjho aur usko bata ki hai, chodo. Kitna paisa hai? Five thousand, five thousand ki baat hai. To uske liye kya karna hai agar wo aapko malum hai to you can help that. But if you just look at the national level perspective. Won't work. 